A's tag, innovate to connect. After installing your Aztec WIPC302 IP camera on your existing network, insert the resource CD of the WIPC302 IP camera on your computer's disk drive. Copy and paste the utility on your computer's desktop. Ensure that the computer that you are using and the IP camera are connected to the same router. Launch the Aztec WIPC302 utility by double-clicking the utility icon. Click the search button to search for your existing IP camera. Select your Aztec WIPC302 IP camera and then click Browse. This will launch the IP camera's web user interface. Input admin for the username and then admin for the password and then click OK. Homepage will be displayed. Click sign in here for the browser and then click quick setup to configure your IP camera. This will display the default WIPC302 settings and allows you to configure your IP camera. If you want to connect your IP camera via wireless, click Scan to search for your existing wireless router. Select your wireless router's name and then input the password on the required field. For the DDNS, you may choose the manufacturer's DDNS or input the third party's DDNS. For the third party DDNS, ensure that you have an active DDNS account before using this option. You may check with the third-party DDNS on how to create and activate an account. In this case, we will use the manufacturer's DDNS. Once you confirm that the settings are correct, click the Submit button for the settings to take effect. The device will reboot and will go back to the same page. Since we are connecting our IP camera via wireless, unplug the Ethernet cable and wait for the network LED to switch off and on again. This will take in about 30 seconds. Launch the WIPC302 utility again. Click the search button. Select your WIPC302 IP camera. Notice that the IP address has been changed. Take note of the new IP address of the camera, HTTP port, and the gateway IP address for our port forwarding configuration. We will use the Aztec DSL 1015 ENL, launch our internet browser again, then input the gateway or router's IP address. Log into your router's web user interface to configure the port forwarding. Click Firewall, and then click Port Forwarding, Select Custom Server, then input the IP camera's name. At the server IP address, input the IP camera's new IP address. For the external port start and end, input 8081, which is the default port number of your IP camera. Select TCP UDP under Protocol drop-down box. Then click Save and Apply for the settings to take effect. You may now access your IP camera via the internet.